Before we start this video on Custom XR's PS Boys, I'm hosting a dope giveaway once again. I'm giving away two $50 rank scrolls to one lucky winner. So that is in total a $100 giveaway to one lucky winner, as I said. So, yeah. How to join my massive giveaway? Please simple like this video, be subscribed to my channel, turn on the post notifications, and comment to England down below, boys. Yeah, and let's go with the video. Yeah, today as said, we are once again back on Custom XR's PS and Custom XR's PS doing absolutely amazing once again. They have right now 262 players online. Boys, that's not even peaked up right now, it's like 1.5pm for me, so pretty pretty early. And they still peak over 300 players almost, so make sure to join the link is scripted down below and yeah today that's my next episode of my iron man and i really really do hope you enjoyed this i'm not gonna bother talking that much let's go straight into it ah yeah before we forgot that make sure to type kong kong youtube go to the open youtube voting page and then we will see a video popped up by me like this one where you can claim yourself a youtube goodie bag and from the youtube goodie bag you can claim a bunch of good things which is pretty damn cool and all you have to do is like this video be subscribed to my channel and type your ign and after that you click on the collect button to claim yourself the youtube goodie bag and same goes with the voting make sure to type kong kong vote so you're good to go good luck on that and let's go straight into it okay so obviously on the start of the first episode we claimed ourselves youtube goodie bags 250 quadrillion bags which we're gonna claim one treasure island teleport and we got the elite boss key which we're gonna open so let's open first of all the voting goodie bags and we get two owners box really good Let's see what else we get more owners boxes. I'm still praying if we can maybe get like something good of these owners boxes. So yeah, let's open the YouTube one. We get more cash of it. Maybe we can get like more owners box would be dope. And five immortal casket. I think it could be worse. And one quadrillion bag. Okay, we're gonna add that to the bank. And let's open the immortal caskets. So hopefully we can get something good. Obviously we. Uh, I think what good for me is right now is the. Um, the uh, boss keys maybe and some cash like I don't need the immortal gear because uh, I'm not looking to to get it to be honest but uh, we're gonna open it anyways let's spin it a few there we go and now we got the owners boxes and I'm still praying for the owners box that we get maybe an owners cape but yeah th that's the wrong cape bro that's the wrong cape maybe owners boots or owners gloves anything anything would help if you um, ask me but let's see um looks like nothing yet another donator cave oh jesus christ i'm not getting lucky with those i swear and that's gonna be more immortal caskets so i'm just gonna spin them really quick really fast and nothing too special i believe so i'm gonna go to the chest right now and gonna see what we can get from the elite boss key all right give me something good and we get demonic shield we already got that so that's not an upgrade and we get eternal helmet what is that that looks interesting um obviously ma oh my that's an upgrade look at that boys that is insane look at the magic uh hit max we got that's a massive massive upgrade i fucking take that man that's like four thousand uh, damage more let's go so obviously we're gonna do another slayer test because we have 1051 points yet and we want obviously the double um slayer xp maybe the double xp ring or the double slayer points ring i think that's making more sense it costs like 5k but i'm trying to collect all these points so we can get that we already bought the five dollar scrolls you got the collector's necklace as well so no need to buy that anymore maybe some progress box i don't know but i'm gonna uh, focus on the slayer ring right now or the two xp ring i don't know uh, i could almost afford that so i don't know man we're gonna see and my first test for today's video is gonna be 40 woolly beast all right let's do that now all right they dropped some interesting stuff um woolly gear so i don't know if that's gonna be an upgrade if i get it but they look quite interesting if you ask me so we're gonna start killing them and we're gonna deal a lot of damage look at this man i'm so happy we got another upgrade i swear on god but yeah we have to kill how many 39 now so 
Hopefully that's not gonna take the long. You see, like it's almost one for me. So, and since we got the collector's necklace, uh, everything is going into the inventory. So, pretty dope. I'm gonna uh, finish the test and then I'm gonna hit you guys up once I done it. Okay, we are about to finish the first layer test. Took me like 10 or 15 minutes, I would say. So not that long. And I realized as well, we got many, many boss points. So, yeah, we received first of all 64 Slayer points, which is pretty damn cool. And I'm curious, on Kong Kong shops, there is a boss point shop. So, we got 700 of those. So, I'm gonna try to find this boss point shop really quick. And once I find it out where it is, I'm gonna spend it for lamps. And with that lamps, I'm gonna see if I can maybe put in Slayer. That would be dope. Okay, that's gonna be the boss point shop. We got like even collector's amulet for 2k boss points. That's actually insane. Donator scrolls and there are the XP lamps. Um, I'm gonna buy one right now. I'm gonna use, see what we can use it. Can we use it for Slayer? And yeah, you cannot boost the Slayer scale. Okay, so I guess we're gonna use the um, lamps for, I don't know, maybe some skilling. So the account looks a bit better, I guess. So, I'm not gonna do that now, but I think once we finish this series, I'm gonna uh, spend it for all my skills. We got some boss keys or anything else, so Ring of Elf, but nothing too special. Cash casket, so not got up at that one right now. Next test is gonna be 33 Devilish Demons, alright. Yeah, huge shout out to my boy Zach. If you like video and comment, you like my comment. <laughs> huge shout out to this dude, man. But uh, yeah, let's finish that up test, uh, this task now. But yeah, as I mentioned before, huge shout out to my boy Zach. Much love, my dude. All right, seems like we are about to finish the uh, next Slayer task, and that brings up we still one twenty one Slayer. Not too bad if. Um, if we're thinking about that, but yeah, another 64 slayer points. We gained another 10 uh, points extra for completing 15 slayer tasks in a row. Pretty dope. We are on the 15 task screen, Jesus. Ah, uh, come on, give me something good and nothing too special. What is that? An Abyss stuff. Yeah, that's definitely not an upgrade. I mean, <laughs> for free, I don't mind. We got the boss keys as well, which we're gonna open. Let's see. We're gonna probably get cash. That's gonna be Obelisk Junior again. Cool, cool. And then we got a full Slayer key. Come on, give me something good. That's gonna be four Crew Scrolls. I have to do the Crew Scrolls soon. So, I don't know. I'm gonna collect them all, but then we have to do them soon. So, don't bother. I'm not gonna bother with them right now. Okay, so this time I decided we're gonna do a raid this time. So, we have the Dracon raid, the Co op raid, and the Oblivion raid. Um, the reason why is I want to gain maybe some dragon gear and I actually don't know if I can manage it to do it uh, solo so I'm just gonna try my best on doing it and yeah uh, hopefully that works do I even have the requirements I do all stats and 15 and seven. okay we got uh, medium one easy rate complete okay so we have to do the easy ones first okay you're gonna do that and uh, we're gonna create a room right here, Dracon straight. We're gonna do an uh, easy one. And you see, like, a zero increased health and zero increased drop rate. So I don't know um, if we can actually do that. But you see, like, we need 70 cooking. So I'm gonna use all my lamps really quick for the skilling parts. So I'm gonna do that really quick. Okay, that's the most XP lamps I could buy, uh, buy. So I'm just gonna put uh, a few and everything in. So they say I have to get 70 cooking as well. So we have thieving here, strength, range, that's fire making, hair plot. But I cannot see cooking right now. There's go. There, there's cooking. Okay. We're gonna put another XP link on cooking. Do I need every 70 stats on that? So if that's gonna be the case, I'm kind of fucked if you ask me. But I'm just gonna put it on every fucking skill. Um, but before we actually do that, we go to the raids again, Dragon's, uh, Dragon's Raid, and then we're gonna shake that. If that's gonna be the case, it's gonna be a bit, but uh, hopefully that's not the case. So let's see if we can start it. Yeah, we need wood cutting now as well. So I think we need all the scaling parts uh, to have 70. Otherwise, we cannot even do the, um, the raid, which is kind of... I don't know, uh, what do I feel about that, but nothing we can do about it. I'm just gonna put all my experience really quick in, and then we're gonna see if we can even do that. Yeah, I'm sorry boys, I was trying to get it, but yeah, we need all 70 skills, so that's kind of fucked. I, 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 I'm not gonna do that on today's video, but if you actually want me to do some raids, I was planning to do it, but yeah, kind of unfortunate that it, that didn't work. Let's do one more Slayer task beside that, so we're gonna kill 38 Bogles, okay. 
So we are about to finish that task as well pretty pretty damn fast if you ask me and on the next episode I decided we're gonna uh, be busy a bit with skilling or maybe I'm gonna do it with um, on my free time but here we go we got the Bogles minigun holy shit um, that wasn't the last kill holy shit I mean yeah uh, yeah <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's pretty cool, but yeah, I don't need it right now, I guess, so I'm not gonna bother using that. We got 1.25k uh, slayer points, which is pretty damn cool. The good thing about Custom Max RSP is if you want to train, I believe you just have to click on the skill, and then you can cl uh, you go to the uh, Ascense Mine uh, ex as an example here. You um, can start mining here, or you go to the Mining Guild, obviously, so uh, skilling shouldn't be a problem at all. There's a mining instructor as well, so he's selling you like some pickaxe, etc, etc, so you can start mining right here. So 77 on each skill shouldn't take that long, I think. So, um, I th maybe I'm gonna do that on the next episode of my private time, or I'm gonna record it, I don't know, but I think skilling is a bit boring, so not gonna bother recording that on the next episode. But, on the next episode, we will do raids, and hopefully we get lucky there. Thank you guys for watching, and make sure to join Custom X RSPS, the link is description down below, and peace!